What's up guys, we're back with another episode. I just got here out in the middle of the desert and we're about to go test the haunted town. I'm pretty stoked, haven't been in this thing in a few months. So, follow along, show you kind of what a day, um, what like testing is with the factory team and the whole crew just getting the car dialed in. I'm supposed to go drive the car, so I need to get suited up. Ready? Ready. Nice. That's fancy Hans device, yeah, dude. Dude, I know. First time ever wearing a Hans device like this, so we'll see how she goes. Hey, look at that. It's got a nice hat. Dude, it's carbon fiber, so it has to be fast. <laughs> so different. It's out of my routine. I've never worn, like, a new neck brace, and I don't know. It's weird. Oh, dude, I still got some chocolate cherry in here. Yeah, we left that in there for you. Thanks, man. <laughs> the changes with this go around Mike this one is uh, just DSC okay. just stiffen up the DSC I think it's definitely more controlled uh -huh. it's just to get it on top of some of that big stuff because in okay. the big stuff it kind of but we weren't charging charging right. you know okay it's tra it, like you're saying weight transfer a little yeah. like brownie yeah I think that it, it shifts the brownie pan a little how you feel being back in a car it's good Not sim racing it's much better than sim racing <laughs> much better very excited I was talking to him and I was like, this is nice, like the wind, you know, I hate, the one of the things I hate in the sim racing is like, when you hit bumps and they try to imitate, like the, like the, the camera kind of moves, and that just makes me like sick, so this like, when you actually hit a bump, it, yeah, that's kind of a cool feature, <laughs> like my neck's actually working, it's not just a screen, it's a beautiful day here. In Barstow, California. Elliot's out driving the car. He hasn't driven in months. Goes out there and sends it first lap. Yeah, as he's driving my car, which I mean, I'm not stoked about, but I mean, at least he's sending out here in the 94 car. But you know, 94, it's it's a hard thing to hold down. Yeah, we'll see his next time by if he really is can handle the 94. But pressure dropped. It was the car like pretty off. Uh, gonna go run new, another loop. Uh, Mike just threw a bunch of changes at it, so me and Evan are gonna go see if it's all that. It's fun, dude. Like, you're gonna rip it, and it's. Dude, quarantine. Dude, I'm getting shaggy, huh? I don't know. I was trying just to grow it out for like a week or two and just see what happened, and it just kind of expedited. I guess that's a good word for it. But, um, yeah, just trying out something new. He's looking a little like caveman. -y. <laughs> yeah. So just finished. Like, we're, we got like a 20 mile loop, and honestly, that last lap was so much fun. It's like a really cool lap. So yeah, you start off, got a little chatter, and then you start going through these hills, and then it's wide open on these just kind of like rolling hills, and you're kind of dropping. And then it gets rough again, and then there's a huge straight where you're just tapped out. And dude, there was some dude in a Honda shirt just in the middle of nowhere, just on the side of the road filming, just thumbs up. We, like I, he's like, 
looks like there's someone on the side of the road. And I was like, what? He's, and I was like, where? I was like, there is someone. And so, so like we started to slow down and the dude's like, yeah, and he's got his phone. So I was stoked on that. It was kind of cool, random. But he had a Honda shirt on, so yeah. Represent. Repping. That was good. Cars getting a lot better. We're just, honestly, that last lap was the best the car's ever driven. So I was stoked on that. Me and Evan, who's riding with me, we were both like just laughing and pumped the whole time. We should be way more serious in there as we're going across some big old whoops at like 70. Riding red with his uh, flame helmet and a three-wheeler. Dude, no visor though. Visor just holds him down too fast. I think too fast for the visor. You know how you saw like Axel Hodges had to get rid of his visor because he's going too fast? That three-wheeler. Seems that everyone on the team has got a mustache except me, so we're gonna go around and uh, rate these mustaches. Roy, I don't know, what do you think? I think that's a pretty solid stash. I think that's at least a nine. I'm gonna give that a nine. Nine point, nine point four. Okay. Nine point four. Oh, you got just a little, a little pedal stash going. No, I don't. I don't like talking about it openly, honestly. <laughs> I'm gonna give that two point five. <laughs> two point five. Oh boy. Wow. Yeah. Now we're with Bill. And I'm thinking Dylan's got the best. This, one. Is, this is about a month and a half right here. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. Roy's got the volume. You have the width. He conditions it. Yeah. It te that's it. The Texas <laughs> long one. That's what I'm going Let's see it. That's genius. I'm gonna give him 9.6. Oh, let's go. We got Mike here. He's just got a simple one. Simple. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna give a solid like seven because it's clean. It's clean. It's not a obnoxious. Kept well. Yeah, maybe an eight. Actually, an eight. I think an eight. Kept well. Very well. Let's He's got the two. long going on too. Yours is just like kind of long, raggy, so. But I like the effort. We're gonna give him a yeah, 6.9. That's, that's my ideal number, dude. <laughs> Last, we got Quinn. He's got nothing going on, really. I didn't get the memo. You guys <laughs> you didn't said, the, yeah, dude, I didn't get the memo either. The email, yeah, okay, sorry. Shave this morning. We're gonna yeah. work on it for the No Shave November for the thousand. I think that's it, right? According to Elliot, he's got this perfect tune in, so we're gonna go see if it's really all what he talks. No. <laughs> Yeah, I can't figure out this whole Barso main thing. I just can't hit it consistently. <laughs> He's like, not too far right. And we were like halfway in between, so I went more right. We're like, oh. Well, the good news is it represents 1% of the type of racing we do in Mexico. Yeah. That's a wrap. Um, just finished up a full day of testing. Made a ton of progress. You just thanks to the whole team. Mike over here at Fox got this thing dialed in. It's cool. It's uh, it's say we definitely got so much more confident. I think both Elliot and I just different. You know, we were this is all new for us, and this car is brand new. So we've had a lot of development, and today it's it kind of all came together in a way. I mean, we still got a lot to learn, but it was just cool to see you finally get a good baseline. And I mean, we we're cooking, hitting some big stuff, and. It's pretty fun. It's a fun car once you get to go. So I'm excited. Go testing again soon, hopefully. But as you guys know, every Wednesday, 9:45, hit that subscribe button. We just hit a thousand subs. So thank you to the first thousand, and now 2,000, then 5,000, then 10,000. But as tune in, tell your friends to subscribe. We're gonna keep doing giveaways every time we hit big mild marks. So.